Welcome to Filmora 60 Second, No More in a Short Time. In this video, we'll teach you how to convert a portrait video to landscape in three ways. Method 1. Cropping The common way to convert vertically oriented videos to landscape format is to simply crop the video, but if you choose to use this method, be aware that you'll probably lose around two-thirds of the shot. Step 1. Double-click on Filmora's desktop icon on your PC or Mac to start the program. Once the welcome screen appears, click New Project to start to convert the video to the landscape. Step 2. Import the portrait video you want to edit into software by clicking on the Import drop-down menu and then select the Import Media Files option. Drag and drop the video clip from Filmora's media panel to the timeline. Once you place the clip on a timeline, you'll be able to see black bars on both sides of the video in the preview window. Step 3. Right-click on the video clip and select the Crop and Zoom option. Once the new window appears on your screen, you'll be able to see five different cropping options. Custom, 16x9, 4x3, 1x1, and 9x16. The 9x16 option will be checked and you need to change that to 16x9 and then readjust the position of the rectangle in the left preview window. The image in the right preview window will show you how your footage will look like after you crop it. Hit OK to complete the cropping process. Step 4. If you want to edit your footage further, you can do so by applying transitions, effects, or creating end credits. Once you've finished editing your video clip, click on the Export button. You can choose the file format in which the file will be exported, and then click Export to start exporting your video. Alternatively, you can choose to export your video directly to Facebook or YouTube account. The video will have a 16x9 aspect ratio once the export is complete. Method 2. Add a blurry background. If you would like to preserve the quality of your video clip, then blur in the background of your vertically oriented video is the best option. Step 1. Click on the Import menu, and then select the Import Media Files option. After you drag and drop the portrait video to the timeline, choose Don't Match. You'll be able to see black bars on both ends of your video clip. Step 2. Head over to the Filters menu, where you select the blur effect you want to use. Filters like Blur Bars, Basic Blur, Rings or Diamonds in the Background Blur can be used effectively to cover the black bars in your vertically oriented video. You can also use the search bar to avoid roaming aimlessly through Filmora's huge collection of filters. Drag and drop the effect you like the most to the editor's PIP track and adjust its duration so it fits the duration of the video. Black bars in your videos should be covered with a smooth looking filter. Proceed to edit your video in any way you like. You can apply more filters, add text, or add music to your video clip. Step 3. Click on the Export button, and then select the video file format you want to use. Filmora offers support for a large number of different file formats, such as MP4, AVI, Move, or MKV. You can also export your video to YouTube directly from Filmora. Method 3. The Auto Reframe feature will detect the focal point of your video and crop it automatically. Follow the steps below to convert a portrait video to landscape video. Step 1. Open Wondershare Filmora, and then click the Auto Reframe feature on the Start interface. Or you can create a new project list. Import the video to Media Library, and then select Auto Reframe. Step 2. In the Auto Reframe interface, you'll see Aspect Ratio, Motion Speed, and Analyze menu. Since we need to convert a portrait video to landscape, select the 16x9 Aspect Ratio first and then keep the motion speed auto. Click Analyze button to start converting. Filmora will convert the video to landscape automatically. Click Export to save the landscape video on local. That's all for today. If you're interested in more useful content, check out filmora.wondershare.com.